Back home, the struggling La Trobe Valley has been dealt another crippling blow, with the Morwell sawmill likely to close because it's run out of logs. The company's 160 workers say they've been taken completely by surprise. Sawmill worker John DeSerio received his certificate for 20 years employment from management just last month. Today, aged 57, he's contemplating how to finance his daughter's university studies from the lengthening La Trobe Valley unemployment line. They've just shut Hazelwood, so there's already 700 other unemployed people before me. Carter Holt Harvey, owners of the sawmill, say their supplier is about to run out of logs because of the bushfires of 2009 and 2014. Other suppliers are too far away to be viable. The Morwell sawmill has been making timber for house construction since the early 80s. The company admits it struggles to turn a profit here, but says the decision to close the sawmill wasn't driven by economics. It is about the lack of saw log available to run this sawmill. The local member wants the state government to help save the 160 jobs that are on the line. If jobs at Alcarra at Portland, jobs at uh, Ash at Hayfield are worth protecting, then so are these jobs in this community. The union says it's shocked and bitterly disappointed with today's announcement. We are calling upon urgent talks with the country to see if there's any way at all that we can mitigate against the impact of this decision. The company maintains no final decision has been made on the sawmill, but it's already putting in place plans to move staff to other sites where possible and pay the entitlements of those who lose their jobs. In Morwell, Dean Felton, 7 News.